Hello, my name is Adam, and in this video, I will be introducing our latest release of Active Guard 2.01. This was publicly released on October 10th, 2024. Okay, let's dive right in. The first feature I will introduce is the ability to search objects on a specified area. This allows you to specify an area within the video to receive thumbnails based on people, vehicle, and face detection. The next new feature has to do with past event searching, and we will start with what that looks like on a Genetech platform as shown in the presentation. This follows the Genetech UI format, allowing users to see event detail including snapshot, the event filter, and Genetech's widget, which allows video player controls. Now, let's take a look at the past event search from a milestone UI perspective. As you can see from the image shown, the user can filter by events, playback recorded video, and add comments as needed for each event. Moving on to the next feature, which is a highly requested one, with Active Guard version 2.01, we now support timeline view for face, people, vehicle, and LPR. A user can also switch between a list view and a timeline view. It should also be noted that this feature is only available in Video Insight and Genetech platforms. This next feature incorporates some new Vaxter functions into the Active Guard plugin, supporting new vehicle types such as SUV, pickups, and minivans. We've also added support for Australian states. A few other new features regarding Vaxtor is Active Guard support for OCR filters. There are two ways to search OCR. First is through OCR Genesis, which is ideal for security and asset management, while OCR Container revolutionizes container code recognition in logistics. Please remember to check compatibility for Vaxter OCR apps on our website. Moving on, this next feature involves the new Genetech style UI monitoring tab. When clicking on the button for viewing in new window, we are now able to utilize the Genetech UI for playback instead of the previous iPro version. Active Guard also shows the watch list name on Genetech's alarm monitoring task, which previously was not included. On Active Guard version 2.01, we now show detail information with watch list name and similarity score. There has been additional improvements to the Active Guard plugin UI regarding Milestone to show both the registered and detected face on Alarm Manager. In previous versions, only showed the detected face. Sticking with Milestone features, when an LPR event is triggered, the entire still image is displayed next to the playback area. We now have four options to show still images on the Alarm Manager. One, both detected vehicle and number plate. Two, detected vehicle only three, detected number plate only, and finally, no still image at all. This next feature is about the Active Guard dashboard and the ability to bring in heat mapping function for fixed cameras, whereas previously this was only available on 360 degree fisheye cameras. Only two features left to cover and we'll wrap this video up, but hang in there because the next two are big ones. First, we have increased the maximum number of face cameras to 100 before the need to add a dedicated Active Guard appliance. We've also increased the number of faces that can be added to a watch list from 1,000 to 30,000. Our final feature is the ability to use an external SQL database and support for standby SQL server. Previously, the SQL database was required to reside on the Active Guard appliance with no flexibility. To wrap up this video, let's quickly recap the major features of this exciting new software release. We've seen some powerful updates that will significantly enhance your workflow and user experience. From the improved user interface that makes navigation more intuitive to the advanced performance optimizations that boost speed and reliability, this release is packed with tools designed to help you get more done in less time. Thanks for watching, and be sure to update to the latest version to take full advantage of everything it has to offer. Stay tuned for more tutorials and deep dives into additional products and features.